bring out the Zamboni and clear the ice. It's game two of the Illinois West Cup Championship as Wabonzi Valley coming in looking for a bounce back from game one, taking on the main hockey team who needs one more win to take the cup. First period, Warriors look to strike first. Zach Pierce shoots the puck right near living room. 1-0 Warriors early. Later on, it's Maine's turn as Thomas Gillespie gets the goal to tie things up at one. Second period, and Maine loses the puck only for Wabonzi CJ Serco to put it in the net. 2-1 Wabonzi. You want more goals? Well, here you go. Wabonzi Zach Pierce comes into your picture scoring his second goal of the game. 3-1 Warriors. Let's show some love to the goalies as Wabonzi's Justin Howard gets a save as he's falling to the ground. Third period action, Howard keeping his eyes locked on the puck and is ready for anything that comes at it. 28 saves on the night for Howard. However, Howard can't do it all as Maine's William Ahn hits the long goal as Wabonzi's lead is cut down to one. In the end, Dubby's defense is too much on the night. They get the narrow 3-2 victory to force a game three in the Illinois West Cup. We played well as a team. Um, we, we came up a little bit short yesterday, uh, so we want to come back and battle hard uh, for each other. And uh, we capitalized on chances, and we played good defense, and we're, I'm really happy about it. It really jumps out at our team. Uh, you know, you always need something to get you going. Uh, I just stepped up and put the puck on net because we knew that, there was, that was the weak point of the other team, so I just came out strong and put the puck on net. We never want to go down game one, but uh, our mentality was treated like any other game. If we overthink it, we're going to lose bad. Uh, we know we're a good team, we're better than them. We just had to come out strong and just act like it was any other game.